Richie, Bulletin Bro Dads, knife review. And I guarantee you, once you see this knife, and at the price point, you're going to go out and buy one. And if you don't, you're missing out. Because, as nothing fancy would say, Hall of Fame all the way. Um, $35, guys. I got this actually for Christmas. It's Randall's Rat from Ontario Knife Company. Rat 1 folder, $35. And I got this in Coyote. Brown, I believe this is the color. And this is a great knife to take with you some type of class or a tactical knife right here. Look at this knife. $35. It is super, super smooth for one hand operation. Really, really, really nice. This is a, I love this knife. I got it for Christmas, 35 bucks, and I'm telling you, it's it's impressive, <laughs> really is at this price point. Uh, a little big for EDC, I guess it depends on the state and the rules and regulations where you live, but um, you can do it because it is kind of light, um, but it's so smooth. Now it's a three and a half inch blade, eight and a half inches overall when opened. Uh, it has an awesome... Aussie 8, Aussie 8, whatever they call steel, it's overseas steel. Um, not too familiar with it. I hear good, you know, good things for it. You know, it's it's made overseas, guys. That's why it's $35. But the quality. Now, this has brass bushings in here. Remember my uh, Tenacious? This is just as smooth as that when opening. It is so smooth. It has two thumb studs. has a little jimping here, which is real nice. I got the serrated one at the toe, you know, it's, I like that. And uh, you can carry this tip up, tip down, left or right. So however you want to carry this, you can carry it. Also, if you want, as a lanyard hole, so you can, you know, put a little lanyard on here. Um, great, great. Like I said, it has two, uh, two thumb studs on each side. $35, guys. Blade HQ. Sweet knife. I love this knife. I took this with me on my last uh, pistol class. Not that I used it, but I just had, you know, I had, a, I said I need a good tactical knife to take. And it's so light. It really is. And it is just easy to do one-handed. And this is, a, this is truly a great knife right here, guys. If you want to get a nice folding tactical at a great price point, this is what you want to get. Right here, 35 bucks. I tell you, I don't spend a lot on knives. No way. Because you beat knives when you use them. But uh, if I can find a good knife under 50, that's that's a deal for me. And uh, this one, this is a this is a steal for 35 bucks. Uh, really, really, really impressed with this knife. You know, I, I always wonder if I had 35 bucks, how good could it be? It is that. It's solid. I mean, this thing is dead nuts centered. You open it up. It's liner locked, okay? Just want to let you know it has a liner lock right here. Liner lock means when you flip it open, this little liner moves here and locks it. And you can just got to depress it to close it again. And for one hand, some knives can be tough one handed to do it. But this one is nice. So, great knife, guys. Um, like I said, it's close to these bushings in here. It looks like brass. It is super smooth. Now, I haven't really put any hard use to this knife. And I don't anticipate, you know, I don't know if you would take it in the woods and beat the shit out of it, you know. But for a good EDC or, well, EDC might be a little bit, but a good tactical knife, I like this. I think this will fit the bill right here. Buy two. <laughs> 35 bucks. They got nice colors. I like this color. It is truly a great knife at this point. And this will be my... I will. I have a couple of more knives I take the tactical, tactical classes. Uh, some knives, will, you know, when I run a little heavy gear, I like a light, light knife. And this will, be the, this will fit the bill. You know, weight is everything. It really is. And this is just a sweet, sweet knife. Comes real sharp. And I'm really impressed when I got this. I, I was hoping, you know, for good quality at $35 price point, and it delivers.
So the Route 1 folder, uh, I believe this is the Zytel handles. Uh, just sweet knife, guys. Highly, highly recommend it. You know, all my knives, you see, they're not expensive, but they are quality. And that's what you look for. You know, American-made knives, some of them are pretty up there in prices. And some of the custom knives are really up there in prices. But certain things you want to look for in a knife, and this one fits the bill. It is dead nut center in there. And uh, nice thumb studs. And just super smooth. That is smooth. Really like that. So I'll do a follow-up in the future. If, if it turns out to break or whatever, I will let you guys know. But for right now, at this price point, it's worth the chance. And it, it delivers. Richie, Bulletin Broadheads, take care, guys. Over and out.